Love is happening today. <laughs> it feels like if something fun because they care about you. Be generous to people by uh, giving money to a charity. In Much Ado About Nothing would like how Beatrice and Benedict fall in love and then how Claudio and Hero fall in love. Love looks like everything is like caring for you. Love is helping people in need. Love is so what do they show to travel? Love is this. My sister, she is usually nice to me. You like somebody and then you, you do other stuff and... Um. Well, the romantic type I probably think is gross, but family member love, I think that's okay. Family fun. It's like family. It feels like a warm feeling whenever you think about it. Somebody needs food. You could give them food. I'd say pet love isn't gross. Love it is me and my dog. Pets? Like pets? He's like my favorite person. I think they love you because they know you. Love is a uh, something in your brain that makes you like someone and want to. Uh, I don't know. Very attached to you and likes you in a way more than just being a friend. Someone can't stop well, thinking about you, I guess. Hi, how was your day that you just hugged each other? Yeah. They care for each other. Love is a warm feeling you get when people like family or friends are around. To me, love is kindness. Struggling with people and, and hugging and stuff. Love is an awkward but fun situation. Love is like being kind to people. Like oh, I don't even know. <laughs> I honestly don't. Like kissing and I don't like it. You like hug me. Love is helping the world. Being nice and kind to somebody. Me being kind to my family and my family being kind to me. When someone tells you like they care about you. I would describe love as weird. Love could be hugging your mom when you get home from school, but it could also be having a crush. In the play, I have a crush. Oh my gosh, I like this guy. I had a crush on a girl and my she had a crush on my friend. You don't want them knowing that you do have one. It's kind of weird because whenever they see each other, they're kind of just like avoiding each other. Boys who are kids or teenagers are just weird. They're almost like girls because they can they're nice. They can be nice to you, like girls. Mm, I don't have a crush. No. I didn't like her back, and I thought she'd hate me for it. And boys like different things than girls. There's this one kid that moved in last year. I don't like him, but he's a good friend. I went up to him and I said, "When we grow up, um, can, can I marry you?" And he was like, "Uh." No. <laughs> Usually girls like to have long hair 
and Boy Scout. I felt shocked and I felt disturbed. They're like, oh, it's fine. And then some of them make a huge deal about it. They think it's a huge deal. Well, because there's a few boys I just absolutely detest and don't like. And I will say anything to get them annoyed. I'm glad that I'm not in it because it has a lot of drama. I love video games. My mom. I love my sister. I love my friends. I love my family. I've had a lot of pets that I loved them. I always think about my family and my pets. A little golden retriever puppy named Murphy and now I love him. Dags. I know dags. Like when I'm sad, I know she'll be there. And when I'm scared, I know she's protecting me. I love my cat. I love my wizard Patrick. Because I really do love to read. I love quality time and um, board games. Couldn't sleep on like the night before Christmas because I was like so excited. I like grapes. <laughs> Most people love food. Food? Uh, I love that ice cream. I love mac and cheese. I love sushi and tacos and uh, nachos. <laughs> I love to do sports. I also love my baby brother. I love my guitar. I love my family. I love Harry Potter. I love nature a lot. I love football. I love my friend. He's just in the classroom right now. I love having my house because some people don't have homes and I'm lucky to have a house. My sister that makes lasagna. I love jumping on the train. <laughs> have unicorns! <laughs> right.